Michelle. Speaking of leadership, have you uh, noticed, uh, I know Kirby wants Sony, Michelle, to, to kind of uh, take on that, that mantle or whatever. Uh, have you noticed them trying to be more assertive out there in that regard? Yeah, I think um, Coach Smart wants us all to be leaders. He even said today, if everybody's accountable to themselves, you don't really have to have a hierarchy. It's everybody, you know, serving one another. And I think that's the perfect example as a servant leader. But talking about Sony in particular, he does have the ability. I mean, he does have, you know, he commands our respect. And just the way he talks, it's just one of those undefinable qualities where, you know, people listen. And so, of course, you know, we're trying to push him towards that role. And I think he's stepping up. And he's doing a great job. Not that he wasn't ever. But like I said, he's taking that next step like we all are. Have you seen more guys in general to follow that up? assert more, try to at least assert more of a vocal presence, given that you know, Kirby has said that, he wants that, so he doesn't have to be as hoarse, I guess, as, as he put it. <laughs> exactly. Um, that's something, once again, he's trying to promote, and I, I think the main thing is, you know, hold each other accountable, but hold yourself accountable. If you can promote that culture, I mean, what, what a beautiful thing. <laughs> Are there any ways that you have tried to step up personally as a leader or holding yourself accountable? Um, personally, I guess this goes back to my faith. I'm not trying to, you know, put this on y'all, but who, it's who I am. Um, Jesus wasn't a commanding, hierarchical, you know, leader. He was a servant leader. I think that's what he promotes. And I think that's the best thing that you can do, and I think that's the best ways you can do it. So, um, one thing that Coach Smart has implemented that I appreciate a lot is the locker room cleanup. What's up, Clark? <laughs> uh, is the locker room cleanup. So, you know, guys have been slacking off. You know, we've all been slacking off. The locker room a little dirty. It's like that's completely unacceptable. I mean, shoot, Bruce, Derek, Eric, Jose, all the guys that are in there cleaning that, um, you know, they don't have to deal with that. So we have just a little extra help uh, every day. There's a certain position segment, and then, you know, someday it'll be all offense, all defense. We'll go in and clean the locker room. I think that, that really shows when you can tell a guy, dude, pick this up or help me pick this stuff up. So it's not a you do this, you do that. It's like let's do this. That's just a minor example of the kind of culture that we're starting to promote. Is that something